And Winkle, one day in this bar, Manolo was telling me these stories of um, filming Tom Penny. And I was like, wait, what? Like, you know Tom? And he was like, yeah. I was like, dude, how could I ever see this dude? Like, I always wanted to just see this dude in person skate. And he's like, Psh, right place, right time, homie. Uh, my name's Amron Jane. I'm from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and I'm 38 years old. I've been skating 23 years and I've been filming since 2004, so 18 years. So uh, Tom was always my favorite skater and he was one of the only dudes I always really kind of wished to just see in person. It was like a myth, like <laughs> you just hear these stories. 2011 May, I was flying out to finish my second full length skate video, Skate Sauce, Hard Times with Good Times. So I get to Barcelona and Winkle's like, yo, like Tom's here. And I was like, get the fuck out of here, you know? And this one day I'm at Makba and I see this just shadow like slowly cruising. I'm like, oh shit, like I'm pretty sure that's fucking Tom. This lady comes and sits next to me. She's like, your name's Amrit, right? I'm like, yeah. And she's like, Guy Mayano, you, you don't remember? And I'm like, well, yeah, I remember I lived with Guy Mayano from like 2004 to five, something like that in his back house. She's like, yeah, you guys came over to celebrate my birthday one day. I was like, what the fuck? Like, holy shit, it's been years. Like, what up? What are you doing here? And she's like, oh, I'm here with Tom. I was just like, what? And she was like, oh, well, um, I was living in Copenhagen and he was just skating Wonderland ramp, kind of like living there and needed somewhere to stay. And so I let him stay at my place and we, he wanted to come skate. He hadn't skated for a while. Like, so I brought him here to sunny Barcelona to, to skate. And she was like, what are you doing here? And I was like, fuck, I'm trying to finish my video, but the homie Vincent got hurt and like, I need someone to film. She was like, perfect. Like, Tom needs someone to film. So it's one day he calls me, he's like, yo, son, like, it's Tom, like, come over, come to the pad, we'll smoke and we'll go skate. And like, so he was like, yo, I want to go do this 360 shove it into this brick bank by the water. He's like, if I land it, we're going to go get sangria on this boat right nearby. And I was like, sick, all right, let's go. We're like cruising down. And he's like, oh, let's hit this right. There's like Be Beirut back here. And I was like, Beirut? And he's like, yeah, that's the nickname for the spots. He's just like, oh, here, like, turn the camera on. Like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to film some stuff. Boom. Trey flipped fakey real quick. I was like, okay, yeah. sick. And then he's like, yo, I'm gonna try to do this uh, little wall ride nolly. Does one, like he does stuff like pretty quick. Otherwise he'll get over it after a couple tries. He's just having fun and then just over it. That one he didn't like cause his hands were still touching. So he was like, let's film a little line. Nolly backside flip. I think he did it again. Could be okay, no? Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that, we did get one more. Ah. And then we went to the spot. This is the spot that he wanted to actually do the 360 shove drop in. He just did one, like, second try or something like that. Then he started doing it again. Boom. 360 shove in. No. And backside 360, power slide on flat. Straight flip. Big tech. Impossible. In the dark. And so then we go and get Sangria on the yacht or <laughs> whatever, you know, he's so hyped on that. I have the photo here somewhere, I'll have to send it to you. And on the way out, there's this little infamous, like you've seen this a bunch of times, Ardo skated it. It's like this um, bank, pretty steep. It's hard to tell on footage sometimes, but we go there. He's like, oh, just a little front blunt transfer over. And does it like first try, kind of like slides down the whole bank, like steezy, like he's just sleeping. And he's like, oh, let me, I'm gonna do front blunt, transfer front 180 in. And I was, I was like, oh, I'm sick, like, all right. Sorry, I'll hit the camera. Yeah, it was, I did. Hey, perfect, perfect. All right. I think he does like first, second try. 
That was first tier. Second tier. Some business suits. Keeping the action. Yeah. <laughs> you made the shot. <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> that was a sick ass clip. I remember being hyped on that. Like, well, did that too. Um, and then he's like hyped, you know. We go across the street, and there's another similar kind of spot. And he's like, "Oh, I want to switch frontside flip into this like steep little bank." And so we go over there, and that's this clip right here. I love how he has the whole like this red and white outfit on too. The red shoes, the red hat, the red shirt, the white tee under. So we get that and then he's like hyped, like, whoa, like we've gotten all these clips today, like, dude, we're having like a really special day. He's like, let's go celebrate at Makba finally, like, let's go. Like we've been trying to get there the whole day, you know, after the trick. At the time when he was drinking, he liked uh, these things called damn limones. Yeah. It's like 60% um, beer, 40% lime juice or lemon juice or something. They're fucking bomb. Like. And we go there and we're, and we're chilling for like a minute, smoke, drink a damn limon. And he's like looking at the like, where the makba ledge is but there's like an up ledge right there and he's like oh i think i can do like switch crooked and then he called him like a chefy flip it's like a switch flip but kind of rolls on the ground like he does it intentionally and then uh switch pop shove it down to like little five stair and i was like all right cool like camera's rolling boom I'm tripping out at this moment. I'm just like, wow, like. Damn, what a day. Oh, oh, what a yeah. day, what a day. That skate size. What a difference a day makes. Oh. So sick, what a difference a day makes. So yeah, after we filmed that day, I was there for another month and a half or so. And so it was like, yo, like, let's just keep filming. We just became like really good friends from that, you know, like just hanging out and chilling. Like he's such a mellow dude that just loves skateboarding. 